photo album commemorating the beginning of the reign of King Charles III. The Royal Collection Trust has released a commemorative book of behind-the-scenes photos of King Charles' accession to the throne and his first months as king. A monarch in the making. From accession to coronation also features Charles attending state visits alongside Queen Camilla. Charles III and Camilla were crowned at Westminster Abbey on 6 May, but officially became king and queen from when the former queen died on 8 September. Last week saw the final part of his coronation when he received the Scottish crown jewels for a trip to Edinburgh. The king is also depicted making large donations and continuing the tradition of sending congratulations to the British public on special birthdays and wedding anniversaries. A would-be monarch will also provide more detailed information on the planning of the coronation, known as Operation Golden Orb. The editor said. The book is richly illustrated with photographs of the king and queen carrying out their new duties, meeting the public and supporting charities. In doing so, it highlights the many milestones that gradually marked the reign of Queen Elizabeth into that of King Charles transformed. Charles has held the title of Prince of Wales since 1958, and no one has held the title of Princess of Wales since Princess Diana, until Charles called her Kate. During her speech, she didn't announce the title change for Harry and Meghan, Duchess of Sussex, but did express her love for Harry and Meghan as they continue to build their lives abroad. Although Charles became monarch after Elizabeth's death, two days after her death, he was formally proclaimed king in a ceremony known as the Council of Accession. The ceremony was followed by the first session of the King's Privy Council, at Charles's initiative reign as king. He was pictured shaking hands with supporters along the Royal Mall during his funeral procession. The Queen's four sons, Charles, Princess Anne, Andrew and Edward, attend to the coffin being carried into the cathedral. They then join the royal company of archers in holding a vigil around his coffin for about 10 minutes, known as the Duke's Vigil. As video from CBS News showed, the monarch's pen began leaking after he signed a book with the wrong date. He handed the queen consort a pen and expressed his frustration when he saw ink on her fingers. God, I hate it, he said. Ink fell on Camilla's hands until an assistant took it from her. I can't take this damned thing said the king. What are they doing? It sucks every time. At the time this photo was taken, Harry and Charles had not been photographed together since Prince Philip's funeral in April 2021, and Meghan and the royal were last seen together in November, 2019. Sussex relations with the monarch have been strained since Meghan and Harry stepped down as senior members of the royal family in January 2020 and further fractured after attending an interview with Oprah Winfrey that aired in March 2021. As the new royal era begins, here are some great books about the king to read right now. Photos show how far the reign of King Charles has come from laying the groundwork for a coronation. Since taking office as king in September 2022, King Charles III worked in several public confrontations to set the tone for his rule. So far, the first 242 days have been eventful. Charles became king after his mother's death on September 8, 2022. Before Buckingham Palace announced the death of Elizabeth II at the age of 96, members of the royal family rushed to stay with her including Charles, Camilla, Prince William, Prince Harry and Prince Andrew, as well as Prince Edward and his wife Sophia. It was not until September 9 that the public took notice of him as a monarch when he